Growing up, I played a variety of sports, uh, dealing with lots of different injuries through the years. And I will say that I, I credit a lot of the people who I leaned on during those times for knowledge, for understanding, so that I could get myself through those injuries. Um, and I think that also kind of left an impact on me and wanting to be one of those people for others. The team here at Wild Cornell Medicine really seems to have a very close-knit community of doctors. Uh, everyone seems to be really interested in, in everyone's uh, success and really everyone is always willing to sit down and talk about cases and really try and optimize the patient experience. The ultimate mission of rehabilitation medicine is to bring to the forefront a, a non-surgical approach to patient care uh, and achieve the level of function that they are searching for. So in my practice, uh, I tend to take care of uh, both sports medicine injuries as well as spine uh, injuries and chronic conditions. Uh, so any patient dealing with uh, an injury, whether, whether it's related to sports or not, um, you know, musculoskeletal injury, shoulder injury, hip injury, knee injury, uh, or spine related conditions um, can come in, see us. The path to recovery is different for every patient and it's unique to every patient. Um, not everyone is coming in asking to run a marathon. Some people are coming in saying, hey, I want to be able to get down on the floor and play with my grandkids. And you know, whatever they're dealing with um, in terms of their condition is affecting their daily life. Uh, so I think that part of what we do is just allowing the patient to explain to us what their expectations are. And I think that understanding someone's goals and understanding you know, where they want to be and where they are now for a lot of patients, it comes down to just giving them information. They need reassurance, they need education, they need information uh, about how they can make themselves better. Opening the images on the computer and looking at it together is really an important thing. And you're explaining the pictures, you're showing them, you're pointing things out to them so that they understand this is what's going on in your body. And this is the, this is the reason why you're experiencing what you're experiencing. Maybe they need a formal course of physical therapy. Maybe they just need a home exercise program. Um, but you know, the sitting down and going over all those mechanics and the anatomy, that's, that's a huge component to developing the program and getting them on their path back to recovery. When a patient's able to get through their rehabilitation program successfully and get back into their previous level of function or sometimes a higher level of function, patients are coming in asking to do more than what they were doing previously. It's a really gratifying feeling to be able to allow them to do that and help them do that. It's what makes us keep coming back and keep trying for more.